from Russia. And right now, the Olympic silver medalist and the world champions, Angelika Krylova and Oleg Ovsyanikov of Russia. She is 25 years old and he is 28. And a very dramatic presentation from Carmen. were the most affected at the Olympics by the controversy. They argue that they should have won the gold medal in Nagano. of the positions as well as the difficulty and variety of the steps and the turns and the movements they've only been together for four years they teamed up in june of 94 then moved to the university of delaware with their coaches with a chuck and cut harness off I know we talk a lot about the deep edges and as a skater that can be just as difficult as the jumps because it is all about muscle control and balance at the same time maintaining speed across the ice. and difficult lift position without being able to do jumps or throws the choreography of jumps lifts small little hops has to be very creative Angelika Krylova and Oleg Ovsienikov. She is known for her extreme expressiveness. Some people say she pushes it too far, but I'll tell you, if you're sitting at the top row of this building, nearly 16,000 here for figure skating, you're getting a heck of a show. Ice dancing, just about over. We'll be back with their scores in just a moment. 
back to Long Island and a very happy couple sitting down waiting for their marks. Krylova and Ossianikov of Russia. And look at this expression. And Peter, I know they say it might be a little too much, but that's what draws me into the ice dancing performance. Mm. Really telling a story, the passion in her face. I agree with you. I think it's terrific. Here are the marks. Wow. Those are big. 5.8 and 5.9. Now the presentation in a 6.0. Huge for them. And again, a capacity audience here at the Nassau Veterans Memorial Coliseum. Two 6.0s. And that certainly is enough for them to win the gold medal here at the Goodwood.